that wild growth and he's gonna go for it. So I think to no surprise, BDS's draft is just very meta oriented and Nola. <laughs> yep. I think that's basically how the BDS drafts go for <laughs> meta champs and Adarius. <laughs> uh, and G2 is just so strong. Doesn't decide to go back vault 1v1 here. And so get a nice trade onto Crowny. And early levels. Uh, so I'm going to feel pretty confident about that trading. A lot more spell-reliant AD carry. Is Caps playing on the edge here? Shio now trying to walk in. Caps going for the slow. Mickey in the area. Shio Flash over the wall from Shio is clean, though. Caps is going to get locked up. Should be more than enough damage coming in for the Elise. First blood donated over to Nuke. That is the perfect situation for BDS. Punish it here, Yike and Mickey trying to invade onto this jungle support of BDS. See if they can find anything to be back from Nuke. If they want to take this 3v3, BDS can. He can get going, but LeBrov is right behind them. Yike desperate to get something back. The knockup is not going to connect. Yike now trying to leap out of safety. He's already burned the E. All the damage reduction starting to fade away. They've taken out Yike. They're going to take out Mickey. It's two. Well. G2, what are you doing? BDS was Sitting there in isolation. They're going to give up this Drake, which I think is smart. It's really hard to face check into the, the Nautilus. One hit hook lands onto any of the four. Looking for Yike. He's going to sweep his way in. Could get hit by... Oh, Mickey, nice blind nice hook there. Step. Who goes in? Mickey just getting chucked out. That's so much damage. Mickey just taken down completely. Over. They can't really threaten anything unless Mickey can find a flash hook here. Setting up the feathers. Root is big on the Crowny though. Now flashing out to safety. Hook gonna land. Alt gonna land on the Crowny. TP. But not enough damage. Nuke now stepping forward, looking for the scoop back. Hansama clean on the ultimate, but the feathers are going the wrong way. Mickey now trying to make his way out to safety. Caps hit gold in favor of BDS. Look at BDS though. So they want to contest the Shio's on the way. No flash on Yike. They can look for a fight here. We'll see if Caps doesn't have TP actually, so it's gonna be a full before. 50 who gets it in the end. Now it's gonna be G2 taking away the Herald. That's gonna be max. Dash out. Yep. And the upgraded form. Yike can dash over the wall. The Herald, that tower is probably gonna go down. This using just force for two. Using the Belveth Void Remora to just immediately pressure the tower. Zoning Crowny away, just gonna break open mid-tier one. That's massive for getting more map control for looking to match on some of these objectives, but have to be careful. Nuke is pretty strong. Yeah, just making sure they get something in response. Trading is so important. G2, no, he's here. Over the wall, Shio. Gonna get stunned up, gonna get knocked up. He doesn't even get a chance to repel into the sky. G2, perfect pick onto Shio, and now Adam is gonna be the one in trouble. Hook hitting the minion. Mickey still on the chase. Adam. Running for his life. Surely there is no way out of this one. The CC immune, the Lulu, will make sure that he can escape in the end. Caps is getting a tower on the other side of the map. G2 or Wolf? EDS. Should just be able to break open this top lane tier one. Caps hovering around in the area. G2, the rest of the team in the darkness, ready to respond. The play. They might be as good as dead. No tower to Geo, Where's Cocoon gonna go? Push back is big from Nuke, getting the ultimate up in time. This Caps can turn into his wow. ladder, but they just cut down Broken Boy. The damage is massive, and Caps is getting nothing done. What goes up must go down, and Caps is certainly going down here. No, a flash out to safety, but now Mickey's gonna die. BDS, they do so much damage. G2. Full string to contest. Have to be careful. We've seen it already. Every one of Shio's cocoons could be a death sentence. Oh, Both gonna go in. They're trying to burn through the elites, and they're gonna take her out. Goal is not able to go up to the air. Hansama taking out Shio, but it's Adam in the backside. Auto attacking Yike, going forward, trying to find the true form, but he will just find his death. Adam running into Mickey X. Hansama, four members still standing for G2. Adam on the hunt. Nuke on the backside, but will not be able to get anyone else taken out. But this BDS, they have so much damage. G2. Trying to stay together, get the Jax, get the, the Belveth, get the Silas on top of one target. Previous fight, Broken Blade leapt into Nuke, tried to flash oh, over the zero off, but that hook could be everything. Shield goes up though, we'll find the disengage. Immediate double TP, and this is going to be the fight. Broken Blade leaping, trying to isolate LeBron, taking out the... Lulu before the fight can even start, but LeBron managed to stay. Oh, going to the backside, and it's big, big damage. Crowny and Shio still standing for now. Caps leaping forward. Good damage, good sustain. But Adam, what they need, Broken Blade ticking, it's burning. burning. Trying to mitigate the magic damage, 25% less. He will survive with the counter strike. Lebrov still trying to keep Adam, Adam standing. Adam, this. so much healing now coming through. Nuke waiting over the wall. The Azir could be massive. Hansama, Mickey X, Caps playing on the edge here. Caps. Oh, maybe they look for Adam here, but uh, trying to take away the crab. Caps is over the wall. He's going to dash onto Adam here. Can he get out? Can he survive? Walking up Adam. Adam, no ultimate. 10 seconds left. Crowny now on the retreat. Big stun coming in from Broken Blade, but he's in no man's land. He has to flash Crowny. out safety. And now Crowny's on the chase, but this is big. I don't know if he can 1v1 the Jax. He's just dodging every single attack, but they turn him into a cute little critter and knock him out. Broken Blade on the map. They can start to force these objectives. Can even look for two towers here as Hans is recalling. Mickey is recalling. BDS capitalizing on the advantage that they have built for themselves. Capitalizing on that massively favored fight. 
taking Dragon, taking mid lane tier one, now looking to get... Maybe BDS are just waiting for that spell, waiting for that summoner Shio, looking for Caps, who's still trying to find something. But Caps is taking so much poke just to even walk forward. Now oh, trying Caps. to heal up, big ultimate might be enough though. Hansama just trying to isolate Crowny and take him out, but Crowny so strong. The last back, is it gonna be big? They take out Crowny. Hansama will trade his life in exchange, but Caps is already down. Yike is on the backside, but everybody on G2 is falling. Broken Blade gonna burn. He goes golden, Yike wants to turn. Yike, this could be his hero moment. Does he have what it takes? It's oh. not enough. BDS will find the fight. Baron Dance is over. BDS win it. Three minutes away from their soul, they're gonna control the map. Massive for BDS, and I cannot wait to see that fight. You can see G2, soul focus, they're tunnel for vision. Oh. Yeah. Right. And every time we want to praise them for Clean League of Legends, it feels like they add something else to the resume here. Yeah. Good things, but the little oh, things matter. The it's correct. Lasers. Duke with the Sand Soldiers, the extra range, the Baron Empowered Minions, they should be able to start to break open the base. See these, these waves are playing four melee champs and a Zaya. How are they supposed to stop these creeps from getting into the base? Botanib is gone. They can start moving into mid if they want, but they're just gonna keep going through. Bot, it looks like, push these waves in, make G2 respond. Caps is gonna get a top tower. That'll be a bounty, but he needs to recall soon and help G2 in this defense. There'll be two cannon minions on this mid wave, and I think they're gonna siege onto this Oh, Mickey, did he just flash hook the wall? I think yes, he did. There's he the did. emote, there's the TP. This I think is fine. Don't think there's an engage here. They just lost the flash hook on Mickey, but they might have to go anyway. They're running out of time. Caps, take away the Azir ultimate. Try to find the angle into the backside. He's looking for it. He gets stunned, he gets locked up, he gets wild growth, but he still manages to push a few back. Nuke into the midst of the team, but he held on to the shifting sands and he will stand strong on the backside. Broken Blade trying to make the difference. 1k gold shut down onto the Crony, jack, Crony, but it's Crony. not gonna be enough. Crown, he's standing tall, taking down G2. Broken Blade gets a thousand gold, it. but it's gonna cost him the game. They've done it. They've taken down G2. We are gonna be going to a game three in this best of three series. Broken Blade trying his best to do anything he can, but LeBron's not giving it to him. Bot waves coming in, mid waves coming in. Looks like Broken Blade is gonna proxy that. Do they have any creeps down here? Yes, they do. 20 seconds on Yike. I think that's game. What a showing from BDS playing calm and collected, not giving G2 anything in these fights. Standing tall as five. These creeps should be enough. Broken Blade's gonna recall BDS. Looking for a minion hit, they don't actually want to commit to the end. Seven seconds on Yike, it's not over yet. You can see them laughing and smiling. They think it is over, and they should be able to push in on the next siege. You flank, ward them off. Botanib's gone, Midianim's gone. Just stay towards top. Don't even need anyone to push the waves in, just in case. Has to come down here. Nuke now jumping forward onto Caps. It's a bit of a split fight. Hansama finds him in the choke, but Adam just walks forward. Hansama has no room to play the game. Just gets cut down, brings the feathers back, but to no effect as BDS are tearing through G2. Caps does nothing on the back line. BDS rolling over G2 in the fight. Five for zero, and they will close it out. G2, yeah, nothing left. BDS have it all. And they're gonna have this game too. So much damage, they can't even get Adam down. He's still full HP, that Mountain Soul, the Gore Drinker, all of them on top of him. And we're going to a game three here. BDS know how much this means.